Earlier this week, we told you about the cross on a prominent Pittsburgh church that was about to fall over. The wind knocked it loose. Well, crews removed it for safety reasons, but they made a special discovery in the process. Julie Grant has the story. This time lapse video shows what occurred over about an hour and a half as the 10 foot cross is being removed from the top of St. Mary of the Mount Church. With the church that's. Um you know, 125 years old, 120 years old at this point in time. You know, I think probably there's just uh, just wear and tear. I think we're gonna have to do some some repairs of of brickwork. The interesting surprise came when they examined what was underneath the protective tin coating. They found out that there was actually gold leaf on it. It, it was it was painted. It was painted, but it was painted over the gold leaf, which was fascinating. Church pastor Father Michael Stumpf keeps a good sense of humor and a positive attitude throughout the whole ordeal. Which makes you wonder: at what point in time in the history of the church did they say, "Let's paint over that gold"? The powerful winds during Thursday's storm are what knocked the cross loose in the first place. We all have to deal with what comes to us in our lives and do it in the best way we can, support and love of others and trust in God. The cross is being refurbished and the area where it was positioned needs some restructuring before the cross will be reinstalled. In the meantime, all the worship in the church will carry on. I'm just curious, is there anything you may put in your sermon relating to this this week? Because it's been kind of an interesting oh, week that's here. That's a funny question. That's, <laughs> I don't know, but now that you ask me, it could possibly make it in there. <laughs> Now a temporary covering is on the spot where the cross stood. There's no timetable for the refurbishment and the reinstallation.